Welcome to the AMP for Endpoints video of how to install and configure the AMP connector for Mac devices. In this video, we will go through the configuration and installation of a new AMP connector for Mac devices. First, we need to create a Mac policy. In the AMP console, navigate to Management, Policies, click New Policy, select Mac and click New Policy. Give the policy a name and a description. The Modes and Engines section displays the engines available for Mac. These are files, which is the main SHA engine and core functionality of AMP. Network, the device flow correlation engine that monitors the connections. Clam AB use a definition based offline detection engines that protects the endpoint from malware when the device doesn't have connection to the AMP cloud. Click Next. In the Exclusions section, we have two types, Cisco Maintain Exclusions and Custom Exclusions. The Cisco Maintain Exclusions are used for the most common applications recommended by Cisco. Custom Exclusions are created and maintained by administrator users. Here we can add files if we want to prevent them from being scanned by the AMP connector. If you want to know more about exclusions, go to the video Create Exclusions in AMP for Endpoints. Once your exclusions are set, click Next. On the Proxy section, you can configure a proxy in case you need it. To finish the basic configuration, click Save. Once you have the policy created, you can use it in a group. Navigate to Management, Groups, find your group and click Edit. Select the Mac policy and click Save. To download that connector, navigate to Management and then Download Connector. Select your group. On Mac box, click Download. Once the file is downloaded, double-click on it. Double-click on the package to install. Install the AMP connector by clicking Continue. Use your password to continue with the installation. Once this process finished, the AMP connector for Mac is fully installed on your device. Thank you for watching how to install and configure the AMP connector for Mac devices. See you next time!